TikTok's hard. Wait, where's my ah? Uh, the fit of the day. Shooting a pollen sage. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Good morning. Hello. It is Tuesday and I am starting out my weekly vlog. Probably should have done it yesterday, I know, but just never really got around to it. I have had a massive request lately just for some more vlogs, so I thought I might as well start just a weekly vlog that's nice and consistent. I'm so happy. Jump on, just show you guys like the little highlights and a couple of snippets from my week training, you know, adventures, everything like that. But, Hobbs, you wanna come say hi to the camera? Also, I'm not naked, I got my bikini on. So we took him for a walk earlier this morning. I am about to jump on the skill board and just play around for a bit. While this little nugget. Oh, your life is so hard. gym now and I've got the new adapt camo on so you can see it's kind of like a mustardy color I'm not 100% sure on this color right now but they do have it in a navy and a green which I'll show you later on this week but sizing the fit is all amazing as per usual again just not 100% on this color I just don't think it suits my skin tone but I feel like it would suit darker skin tones so much better all right. TikTok's hard. Okay, let's see if that works. Felt like I was falling a little bit. Whew, okay. <laughs> We're going to a radio shack. It's like one of the only places around here that would sell camera gear. Anyway, we're getting some podcast stuff because Move With Us is becoming a podcast. Rachel and Emma, who have their own podcast, are actually, thank you, we're rebranding and making a Move With Us podcast. So your girl is going to be a part of that podcast. He's literally got one sock on. <laughs> making some raisin toast because we're about to go to the beach. One of them's mine. And I'm just... It's not. I'm serious. Babe wants my gains to shrink. I don't want your gains to shrink. Yeah, you're like, I'm enough with a titty pecs dancing. I don't want to see that anymore. I've never said Ooh, that. Yeah, lose your gains, bro. I'm not giving you no more raisin toast. That is not what I'm doing. That I... is not what I'm doing. I'm from Australia. That's not what we do. We just lock down. That's it. Whatever. Okay, 
guys. If you have never been to Cabo, you have to come. It's the most beautiful spot. It's just magical, honestly. It beats the east coast of Mexico 10 times over. Tulum, Cancun, Playa del Carmen, all of those places. Do not go there, just come straight to Cabo. It's insane. Wednesday, hump day. Going on a walk. New outfit on today. It's low rise shorts. I know. Serious, serious. Britney Spears 90 vibes. That's true. So I'm putting on my shoes. We're going for a walk. We're going for a walk. Didn't even pick up on my American accent. I'm Jim Shark out. If you didn't know I was Jim Shark out, would you be able to tell now? Show them girls like. Let's go get some yummy, delicious dessert breakfast. What'd you get? Oh, what is that one? <laughs> chocolate. That's chocolate. So what's the other one? Yeah, that's it guys. Chocolate and almond. Been decided we're going golfing. But today I'm not gonna worry about that, I'm just gonna worry about having fun. Nice. Harbour Country Club for today's golf spot. We fancy. Al is up, then my shot, then Steve's. Morgan smashed a great drive with her three It was wood. just clean, you know? You did too. We're both in the fairway, both at three wood. Shit, maybe there's... <sighs> Let's have kids right now. Uh, no kissing on YouTube. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Guys, I don't know if you can see, but that bright pink ball right there is mine, and then that is Steve. Granted, I hit mine about 270. Like, legit. Morgan hit hers so well off the red tee. And now we're that This close. is my ball, and Steve's is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six and a half meters from mine. It's been a rough few holes. I am just off the green. Flag's up there, babes over the other side. But it has been craziness. Steve hasn't had that great of a game, neither have I. Gotten one par. The rest of all, been pretty bad. Putting's been all right, but all right. Okay, so last time I spoke to you, we were struggling out on the golf course. We ended up finishing our nine, obviously. But it is date night, so we literally just got home. I've gotten dressed into just a little date night fit. So I've got this little pie crop that I got from Zara. Jeans from People Versus and shoes from Billabong. Very beachy chill vibes because the place we're going to, we actually went to last week and it was really, really chill. So that'll be it for tonight. I'll show you the yummy food and the cute dog's eggs. They're the best. We are here at Ekr. We're going back to the puppies. Oh my God, they're so cute. Anyway, so this is what we're going to do just before our dinner. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi. Yeah, this so is the sweet. mama. Hi, darling. Oh, sweetheart. Oh. Hello. Oh my gosh, these little goats, babe. Um, hello. Hello. Wow. Look how red it doesn't even, can't this, even pick. This is embarrassment. This isn't a sunburn, this is embarrassment. Morgan made me get rid of 10 kisses. 
which did, they didn't count if she didn't participate in it. She got to determine what was and what wasn't a kiss. And I had to sit here in front of all these people giving her kisses. It was like humiliating. And Steve made me kiss him 10 times. That's not and true. And if he didn't want to participate, it didn't count. And everyone can tell so you. Everyone so can tell you're tipsy. Come on, tipsy. You are. Ask what me is to this? Do okay, take your birth year. Yep. Minus it by 10, add 5, minus 10, add 5, minus 10, add 5. What year is it? <laughs> Go again. What? Take my birth year. Take your birth year. Yeah. Minus 10. Yeah. Add 5. Yeah. Minus 5. Add 10. What yeah. year is it? Minus 10. Add 5. Minus 5. You're drunk. Plus 10. Yeah. 1996. There you go. <laughs> Just woken up, had a little bit of a lazy morning this morning. I just did my little daily journaling, my questions that I've been doing lately. I have my first ever session with a psychologist, so I'm really excited. Steve and I actually, I don't know if you guys know this, but Steve and I actually did a premarital bunch of sessions with like a, he's a premarital counselor. So you talk about things that are usually big parts of a marriage that maybe you haven't spoken about before. Like how you're gonna raise your kids, how are you guys going to split the money and the costs and the living and blah, blah, blah. Like really deep questions, which you would only really know the answer to unless A, you've spoken about them before or B, you've gone through that whole life lesson with your partner already, which we obviously haven't. We live opposite sides of the world, so we did premarital counseling and Steve has actually gone to this guy for quite a few years just in regards to really trying to figure out why he feels some way why he does certain things and the same thing is what I'm gonna do for me so I don't necessarily have a reason as to why I'm wanting to see someone like this it's more just to have a chat even break down the way that I feel and things that I do that's around my day-to-day -day life things that may upset me things that may trigger me like little things like that so I'm super excited to see how it goes wish me luck Alrighty, let's show you guys the fit of the day. So we've got Metcons, Gymshark socks, the new green camo, favorite color by far. I showed you guys the yellow camo the other day. The green, she's a winner. Paired it with a Gymshark hat. This is a vibe. So I just finished my session with Matt. It was really, really good. It was so nice to talk about just a whole lot of things with someone who's very knowledgeable in what I should and shouldn't do with certain things. So we spoke about a whole range of things, literally my whole life. So long distance, where I am career wise, where I'm in my life, relationship stuff, obviously, friendship, family, a whole heap of things. So it was really, really nice to kind of chat with him about those things. Obviously not going to go into detail with you guys about that.
that because it's nanya, but it was really, really good. So I'm very happy that I did that. I'm probably gonna do that at least every fortnight or once a month. I just think it's a good time for me to check in and see how things are going. Someone that I recommend and someone who actually reminds me of Matt is this guy, Matthias Barker. He is so amazing. He honestly is just like soothing to the soul. He seriously is. Have you seen his stuff? Yeah, when you when you guys shared him in the UK. Yeah, I freaking love him. His stuff and his stuff comes up all the time. It's it's really good. He's so good. Right, what are we doing? We're going to get possibly fabric or paper. We're going to shoot their Apollo and Sage stuff, studio style. Yeah. But there's no studios in town or around here, so we're doing. We're making very, do with our garage. We're doing very DIY. So just the new stuff, but that is what we're going to go set up. So let's go do that. Alrighty, Al is getting set up so we can shoot. We're not gonna shoot today, but we're gonna shoot sometime soon. Got our materials. This is our garage. This is the space that we're gonna be shooting a pollen sage. We have just had some friends land in from Utah, so we're actually gonna go spend some time with them, go out for dinner, just chill for a bit. So that's what we're doing tonight, which is also why we're not shooting. And then we're probably gonna shoot maybe tomorrow. Al's onto it though. Good morning, guys. It is Friday. Holy moly, your girl is struggling. So I probably got about three and a half hours sleep last night because it is my time of the month. I was just lying in bed last night, got some wild cramps pretty early on. Felt like I couldn't sleep. I just kept tossing and turning constantly. I was a little bit confused because it didn't feel really bad. I just felt uncomfortable. Yeah. It's 8.30 now. I did have a little bit of a sleep this morning when I could just bear to, I guess. I didn't want to wake Steve up, so I actually went and slept in the lounge room because I was literally moving maybe every couple of seconds. I felt annoying, so I didn't want to do that and wreck his sleep. But yeah, just outside now. I've washed my hair, and I'm actually just trying to dry it naturally with a little bit of, like, the scrunching thing that they do for the curly girl method. My hair is actually quite curly. It gets very curly after salt water, when it's raining, anything like that, so I feel like I have have curly hair I just don't know what products to use and things to do because I'm not a products kind of girl I don't put products in my hair other than like shampoo and conditioner and maybe an oil so let's see how this goes but I'm literally sitting here I've got my phone which I'm not even using I've got this head wrap kind of thing that I'm scrunching my hair with whilst feet are on my book and I read how's that okay here's how it turned out I don't think it's anything special but I do know you have to commit to it for quite a long time. So I'm going to do that routine at least for the next couple of weeks and see how it goes. It is quite curly. my bikini i think i'm gonna go down to the pool and just relax and read for a little bit motivation is not through the roof it's obviously like i mentioned to you guys this morning the first day of my cycle so i'm not feeling the best so yeah i'm just gonna go down to the pool relax but i've got the bedina top on in hunter which is a like dark green it's almost like an emerald green then i also have the morton bottoms on so I kind of mix and match this set for this one. This is like my ideal tanning bikini because it's very minimalistic. Your view versus I've been up since I'm in bed, but I've been up. I made tub made me toast. Took Hobbs outside. We sat outside for a little bit. I'm just watching the Ryder Cup. My name is Raul, and I'm going to be your captain today. Let's send it.
Sunday, the last day of our weekly vlog, Hubs and I are chilling in bed. Steve got up pretty early and went to play 18 holes with his friend who's visiting in Cabo. You guys would have seen them yesterday on the yacht. I am not doing much today. I've just been really lazy. It's eight o'clock and I'm still in bed. Usually I'm up somewhat early. But I just didn't feel like it today. We're gonna get up and we're gonna go for a W-A-L-K. I can't see it because it'll get too excited. We're gonna go for a walk. I'm gonna go for a walk. I'm going to grab a juice, come back, sit down, do a little bit of work for the morning, and then I'm just going to, I don't even know, to be honest. I've got one more workout for Move 28, which is so exciting. Hello. Hello. And then I am Dunzi, so I need to announce my week four winner. And I need to notify the team of our overall Move 28 winner, which is someone who is going to win a whole heap of gift cards to my favorite places. What are you doing? <laughs> Hobbs isn't actually allowed in the bed because he gets hair all over the sheet, so we kind of just let him sit. <laughs> Holy sh! Anyway, I'm going to get changed. Take this little nuggy for his W-A-L-K. Alrighty, so I am in the gym. Today is the last day of Move 28 and I actually have an outdoor cardio day. I'm going to do that later this afternoon, but for now I'm actually just going to do a full body workout with some of my favorite exercises. Get moving and get ready to kind of kick back into gear with my intuitive training. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing. I've got the bandeau crop top on, the low rise shorts that are coming out soon with Gymshark, my Metcons and my socks as always. Let's go. I'm studying like a milli rocket. Skin clear, still look your Andy Miller knockers. Money in my pocket. Don't call me a money pocket. Engine get to rocket. It sound like a thunder rocket. Yeah, I still love my baby even when it's toxic. Crazy like she Benny but no, she don't shade a knock. Russell Wilson, way I get low and stay in the pocket. I get paid and do my dance like a touchdown. Yeah, I can't do no time, only that gun around. In my teens, we were acting up and running around. Now we're grown, still get to it if it's necessary. On the ground from January to January. Never met nobody who retired when they were young. They were young, so I guess I gotta get it to the cemetery go, go. Getting paid just for rapping is fun. It's fun I let up around a month in every nephew where Yo, yo, yo. Side, no electric, electric. Yeah. It's getting hectic, hectic. Seven, seven, seven. Yeah. Yeah. seven, seven, seven Yeah, yeah. Told him side, no electric, no electric. Yeah. It's getting hectic, yeah. seven, seven, seven Yeah, yeah, seven, seven, seven Couple of them one in my head just to say they did it Can't lie, I'm so paranoid and the window's tinted I own everything around me, you can say it's rented no, no, no. Not talking phone numbers when I'm talking seven digits Earn it by the day, every second minute Used to pay me none, look, now they pay attention Everybody said they drip, but I banded it See them copy all the looks, but I stay switching Pick up the loop, then hit the bank Can never change, still wrote the change Captain say the pay, this say the day They made me wait, I'm breaking chains Yeah, yeah Tell me feeling bubbly out the rose. Took a minute, but I got it out the slow way. Friends turn to foes, haters tell them go away. Rappers make a shiggy dance like a soul train. Tell them side, no electric. electric. It's getting hectic. It's getting hectic. Seven, seven, seven. Yeah. Seven, seven, seven. Yeah. Tell them side, no 